Okay, what's your question? Yeah, uh, so today that's solving this interesting question that I just uh, recently found. Uh, it's very interesting. So the, idea, the problem is that the, the, uh, there's an end and then there's a blind spider, there are opposite corner of the cube. And then the end is stationary and the spider moves in a random one, uh, one corner to another long edge only. What's expecting number of turns before spider uh, uh, reach the end? Okay, so I mean, you guys can, can take your time. <laughs> okay, so let me just provide a solution. So the idea is this, right? We have a, we have a box. Oh, by the way, yeah, hope you guys subscribe to my channel. And then you, if you want to have more uh, interesting probability or interview question that uh, the list that I built previously, you can click the link below. Okay, so the idea is this, and then we have ends. Right? So ends is here. And then there is a spider. Okay. And then what we are going to do is to find the, the, the expectation, expectation value, uh, the expectation number of terms that spider uh, 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 reach ends. Okay, so the ends is stationary and the spider move at random. Okay. Okay, so what do we do? Uh, what do we solve? So you usually, uh, uh, usually you can solve this problem by uh, using the uh, using the recursion so you can view uh, this type of problem has three kind of configuration uh, by symmetry it has three kind of configuration right this is that's called this that's called a number of this is x1 so x1 means that expansion number of a spider go to ends and then we have another two configuration we have this configuration and the least configuration Right, so by symmetry, so ends is always here. So by symmetry, there are two kind of situation. Right, one is spider go here, one is spider here. So uh, due to the symmetry, right, there is a least uh, there are on the same face but opposite. There are different face but opposite. There is another final case is here. Okay, so you can, uh, for example, if a spider here, this is the same as this situation. So due to the symmetry, we only have these three kind of configuration. So let's call this X2 and X3. So X2 is an expectation number from spider go to end. X2 is an expression number from spider go to end. X3 is a spider, uh, X3 is this kind of situation. Okay, so we can have the, we can write down the equation. Okay. Uh, okay, so very simple. Uh, Let's consider, uh, let's consider it X3, right? So if I, I'm spider, I go here. So X3, I have one third probability that I, I then I will hit it. And I have one third probability that I will become X2 and one third probability I will become another X2, right? So I have two third, one plus X2 because I already take one step, right? So it should be uh, one plus X2, okay? Now uh, let's consider X2. So for this spider, uh, for this diver, uh, I, I can go this way, this way, and this way, right? So uh, for X2, I will have one half probability to be, uh, by have three, two divided by three probability that I will become the F X3. And I have one probability, one, uh, one third probability to become X1. Okay, so finally X1, right, X1. So X1 have, uh, it's here, right? You can go here, here, or here, right? So obviously x1 is three times three, one plus x2. Okay, so now we have three uh, equations, three variables. Okay, so let's uh, click, let's uh, clean, clean it. So we have uh, x, uh, we have x1 equals to one plus x2. And then we have x2 equals to, uh, so we, we already finished this. Let's call it, uh, we have uh, what? One plus, okay, so we have one plus two divided by three, uh, two divided by three, x3 and uh, this x1. Okay, for x3, we have, uh, we have this, right? So we have, uh, one plus two divided by three x two. Okay, so three variables, three equations. Uh, we can have fun, right? So we can try to solve it. Uh, I mean, you can solve it by by, by yourself. So let's let's quickly solve it. 
So what do we do? Mm. Okay, so we prog. So let's solve this, right? Because Y can replace X1 to be X2 and replace. Oh, sorry. Oh, sorry, this is X3, I'm stupid. Okay, so we can plug X3 and X1 into a second equation. So we get X2 equals to one plus two divided by three, one plus two divided by three, X2 plus one third, one third plus X2. Okay, so we get X2 equals to one plus two divided by three, four divided by nine plus three. Okay, so uh, what's this? So we get uh get what we get x two equals to uh the, the, the two plus nine seven x two so we get uh two x two divided by nine, two so x two is nine okay so which means that uh x one is ten and the x three is uh six seven okay okay so now we have answer ten nine seven okay so let's go back ten nine seven okay so answer is ten okay that's it see you guys next videos